What's going on DMG clan? Today I'm going to show you guys how you can add an SD card or a micro SD card to your A and Neo Next Lite or any other Windows handheld PC that doesn't have a slot for this. So let's level up our gaming knowledge even more in 2024. So you got yourself the A and Neo Next Lite, but there's no micro SD card slot. You tried to put it in the USB port, but then you damaged your micro SD card. I don't recommend this, by the way. You didn't want to open up the back because you don't know how to do any of that to change out the NVMe, which is possible, by the way. But a two terabyte NVMe costs about 150 to 200 bucks and having to tear this apart to do that really isn't sensible unless you're downloading a whole bunch of games. This thing only came with 512 gigabytes of internal storage. So the games that I like to play, I was able to fill it up pretty quick. There's no slot on the bottom. There are speakers, which are down facing. I'm not going to go there, but you don't know any other option to add emulation games other than the option that I'm going to show you here today. That option involves couple little dongles that cost together combined about 15 bucks and I'm gonna show you those right now I have this angle USB 140 watt 20 gigabytes per second angle kind of dongle it can go up here it can go down below just depends where you want to put it and it doesn't interfere with the actual device because the device is risen up high enough so that it'll actually just sit in there nicely. But how do you put your USB micro SD in there? You can't. Well, I'm gonna show you how. So there's another little device that I discovered. Now it would be cool if this came as an all-in-one kind of function or feature, which is a micro USB to USB-C adapter. When you attach this right here, that just sits there right flush, right onto the actual device. You could actually probably just maybe tape that down or glue it down or something if you wanted to. I like to put it up here just because of gravity and it holds it in there nicely. Now picking your USB-C port obviously is all up to preference, but as soon as you put your micro SD card in there, you can actually just unplug this for a time being. This has all of my ROMs plugged right in. And like I said, if you wanted to tape that down, maybe with some double-sided tape or something, or even super glue it, there's my micro SD card loaded right up. So now I can go into emulation station, for example. Note, I've already got this all set up through emu deck. So I selected my micro SD card through emu deck and I can navigate through all my games that are preloaded right off of my micro SD card. So if I go into some Donkey Kong Country, this is loading directly from my micro SD card and I can just play Donkey Kong Country on my A and Neo Next Lite and I don't even have to worry about configuring the internals, changing the MVME, which I'm probably going to do anyways eventually. But I just thought this would be a cool little thing to kind of share with you guys because I'm going to put an affiliate link in the link in the description below so you can go buy one and then you can learn even more. That you didn't even know because i think this little dongle is actually something that everybody should have and it's not even good just for the a neo next light it's good for even adding more storage to your a y n odin 2. you've already got a micro sd card in here you've already got the internal storage in there and then you got another micro sd card inside the bottom if you wanted to you could just use the same one and it also works nicely if i pull this out i don't know if it's gonna crash but there you go look it fits on the back too. It's not maybe the best thing in the world, but it doesn't inter true interfere with anything. And it looks nice, sort of. That's about it guys. I thought I'd share that today because I thought it would just be a little cool little thing just to share. And I thought it would just be nice because it's so right. That's it. Micro SD card in the top. And there's a problem because I unpl unplugged it. And yeah, okay, that's fine. But I'm still able to play my video games on my a Neo Next Lite. And I really think Donkey Kong Country looks good on this device. That's it. Don't forget to subscribe if you like this sort of content. 
This is a little bit of a different one, but I thought I'd share. Again, in the air. Learn like you don't care. <laughs>